Well, tonight, local and state leaders of the NAACP are demanding a call to action to fix the Indiana hate crimes law. On Saturday, they will hold a rally to protest the law and call uh, for changes. Taylor Williams spoke with one local official who will be at that rally. She joins us now in the studio with more. Taylor. Thanks, Mike and Sadie. Indiana was one of five states without a hate crimes bill until Indiana Governor Eric Holcomb signed it into law last month. However, some say the bill is just not strong enough and it needs to be changed. We're a taxpayer and we deserve to be protected. Saturday, community members and residents are expected to pack the steps of the Vigo County Courthouse to protest the Indiana hate crimes law. Anytime that anybody is being oppressed, we have to come together and make sure that the laws change for the betterment of our citizens. Similar rallies will be held across the state on Saturday, hoping to protect the most vulnerable. The Indiana hate crimes law was signed into law back in April. The law protects against race, religion, and disability discrimination. However, it fails to list gender identity, gender, sex, and age. Some residents here in the Wabash Valley are noticeably upset. President of the Greater Terre Haute branch of the NAACP, Sylvester Edwards, says the law fails to protect Indiana residents. So they've got 92 different ways of looking at things instead of having a bill that is inclusive, which would say the judge or the system or the law shall, instead of may, make determination whether it's a, 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 a hate crime. Edward says that's why the rally is so important and that everyone needs to join together to make the law more inclusive. And as Indiana goes, the rest of the country also. So this is like a test lab for the rest of the country. That's wrong from the beginning, is wrong in the middle, and is wrong at the end. Edward says the rally will be the first of many. The goal is to have a rally on the same day in all 92 counties to show lawmakers that this is an important issue. All right. Thank you, Taylor, for that information. The rally is this Saturday at noon at the Vigo County Courthouse.